welcome back to my channel. My name is Nina. Thank you so much for clicking on here. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you that continue to watch me. Welcome back. As you can tell, I am not in my normal situation. I'm actually inside a yurt for the very first time ever. I'm camping in Arizona. I have not been here yet and it is absolutely gorgeous and beautiful. If you haven't been out here, please do. You deserve to see the mountains and the rocks. It just makes you wonder how small you really are and it really puts things into perspective, at least for me. But that being said, I want to give you a full tour of my yurt, which isn't much, so let's start with the outside. So here is the outside space. You can see that there is a picnic table and actually a fireplace. So we are going to cook s'mores and have a good old time. On the outside, you can see that we have some chopping wood available because we can build fires not only outside but also inside to keep us warm. This is how the yurt looks like outside. Beautiful scenery absolutely amazing with tall trees and no clouds in the sky so as we walk in you just take a step up and here it is basically it is so small but it's absolutely gorgeous perfect for camping and they have bigger yurts if you are a family of six they have that as well but it's right now just me and my business partner because we are filming a wedding out here which is super exciting but here is the fireplace <laughs> you just open that baby up it already has wood available really perfect really easy we have a flashlight just in case. Look at that. <laughs> you can see the outside. I am not sure if you know this, but yurts do not come with any form of electricity or Wi-Fi. So good luck. This is real life camping, guys. So we have a cooler that we're gonna keep our waters here stocked inside if I can find a way to open it. We got some ketchup and mustard for the wiener dogs we're gonna roast and definitely make some s'mores. And we also brought this light. You just kind of wind it up and it'll wind itself to turn on Lysol spray because we still are in a pandemic very well aware and we got some sleeping bags here the cottage itself or the yurt did come with a mattress but you want to keep warm so I really recommend you bring your own sleeping bags because the insulation will keep you warm I also love the fact that the yurts come with a ceiling so you can lay down your mattress here and then you'll just be able to look at the sky look at the clouds it looks absolutely beautiful. You can see the trees. Ah, oh, so gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. I can't believe I am here finally. I've been thinking about this trip for so long and it's finally happening. It's not all sweet, of course, because again, there is no electricity or anything like that, no Wi-Fi, but hey. If you want to get away from civilization, this is the way to do it. And not to mention the hotels here were super expensive, like $230 each per night um, when a yurt itself is 40 bucks. Granted, you do want to spend money on a sleeping bag and supplies, but even so, it is a lot cheaper. It's definitely more of a bang for your buck, plus you get the amazing camping experience. So yeah guys, I'm just gonna explore the outdoors a little bit more and I'll see you guys soon. <laughs>
guys, what's up? I am sitting in my rental car right now. Today is the big day. It is the wedding day. I'm helping film. I'm so excited because this is my first wedding that I'm helping film ever. So I'm gaining a lot of insight just on how to do it. And hopefully this leads to bigger things. It is a destination wedding. So I am in Arizona. It is so crazy to just have a rental car and just see the mountains and just dirt everywhere it is so different from Florida I mean there's mountains and it's just exciting if you're afraid to travel trust me I've been there I had second thoughts about coming here just because it's a new place you know you don't know what to expect but once you do it and you get used to that feeling it is such a motivator you know you feel driven and you want to do it some more so that is what I'm gonna tell you. That is my advice for you today. But I am headed to Walgreens because my business partner needs a few things. So I don't mind going out for a run because honestly, my skin is so dry here. I love it here, don't get me wrong. But I mean, it's just desert here, so I need lotion. I need lotion. Thank <laughs> you. 